Hey guys, Justin Andrews, certified personal trainer, founder of Stick With It Fitness. Um, today I'm going to tell you about my diet because I have a lot of people that ask me, like, what is your diet? What are you eating? So I'm going to go into this. I'm going to show you exactly what I eat on a daily basis. And let's go ahead and make a trip to the Frigidaire. <clears throat> so in the morning time, I'm eating bacon. I have some eggs in here, right there. Uh, water. Um, so in the morning time, my breakfast is usually like maple sausage, three or four eggs, a couple slices of bacon, and water. I don't do any dairy, no cheese, no artificial soft drinks, no orange juices, or nothing like that. Um, and really, Mine is for personal reasons. I don't do too well with high sugar foods. I, it, I don't know. I, I just don't feel right. My whole well-being doesn't feel right. I get a little dizzy. So I stay away from like the juices and stuff. And I think I'm lactose. That's why I don't do dairy or cheese. I get really bad off. Like I, can, I get really sick feeling. Like a tingly feeling. Heart starts racing. So I stay away from all dairy. Um, in the cabinet here. Uh, let's see. So I have canned chicken. My diet is high in fats and proteins mainly. Vein of sausage. This is stuff I'm eating daily. Like I'll, I'll snack on these. Uh, peanuts. Planters. I eat those throughout the day. Got my bumblebee tuna in here. Like Jim Carrey says, bumblebee a tuna. Um, so I eat tuna during the day. Uh, I'm I'm pretty big on beans. That's that's carbs and protein. So I do you know get my carbohydrates. My carbs is is a lot lower in my diet. So I like lima beans, butter beans, black beans. Um, let's see, almonds. I snack on these throughout the day. I love those. And then sometimes I will eat saltine crackers with the peanut butter. Um, so that's, you know, a little bit of carbs in the crackers. Um, <laughs> this is my sweet tooth. I have a craving for this stuff right here. The Goober's peanut butter and jelly. I really like this stuff. So yeah, I eat some of that. I'm not going to lie on my daily. So but as far as bread, I don't eat any bread either. I actually give that to my dog, Sam. Over here sleeping like a boss. He loves him some bread. So, these are things that I eat pretty much on a daily basis. And I don't eat a lot of fruit. Um, I don't feel right when I eat fruit, too. If I do eat fruit, it's like blueberries. Uh, let's see. Blueberries and... Gosh... Where are they at? Oh, grapes. Blueberries and grapes is like the two fruits I eat. Um, sometimes I'll eat a little cantaloupe every once in a while. But I tend to stay away from the, the sugar because I really enjoy eating like fruits and stuff. And I cannot <laughs> get the discipline to eat it in moderation. <laughs> so that's why I tend to stay away from it. I, I used to eat it like crazy and I didn't feel good I know my blood sugar was probably like through the roof so I stay away from a lot of fruits um, so I eat brats I love some Johnsonville brats again fats and proteins uh, far as oh let's see Pedialyte that's for the cat too. My cat gets dehydrated sometimes, but I will drink some myself after a hard workout. I actually say it's better than Gatorade, um, but I won't go into that. <laughs> Tyson's chicken. So I, I eat, you know, that stuff like that. Stir fry. You know, I eat veggies every time I eat uh, meats and stuff, protein. So I got broccoli in here. I've got uh, cut green beans. Uh, turkey burgers. There's some turkey burgers right there in that box. 
and I got a lot of chicken. A lot of chicken in there. I eat grilled chicken every day, every single day, and eggs. Uh, so this is pretty much my diet on a daily basis, and I, I want to do this so people know because they always ask me and stuff and how I stay so lean, um, which it makes total sense. I, my carbohydrates is low. I drink nothing but water, um, and the meats and veggies are high in my diet, which I do have some, you know, the goobers jelly and stuff like that, but as much as I work out, my body uses that, that sugar. And I stay away from dairy, juices, no soft drinks, uh, no bread. And these are the things I've, I've been able to do myself to stay so lean and muscular. And this is how I eat. I eat, Even when I go to fast food places, I will take the bread off of a burger. I don't eat bread on the burger. No additives, no ketchup, no mayo, no mustard. <laughs> but this is just me. Uh, I'm just telling you how I eat. And I like salads. I love salads, but sometimes it upset my stomach. So I don't eat them as much as I used to. But every once in a while, I still will eat them. As uh, far as herbs and spices, these are like the main three I use. Let's see. Paprika garlic and basil I, I love using those on my foods which I, I don't use a whole lot because my stomach is sensitive to a lot of things so I've learned to use moderation um, I'm just trying to cover everything here for you guys uh, far as supplements I don't use any supplements at all and that's just me it's my personal thing I'm not saying you know if you're using pre-workouts and whey protein powders and all that that's fine if it works for you you know keep doing it but me personally I, I don't and I believe that's pretty much gonna cover everything I'm just checking to make sure I'm not leaving out anything so in the morning you know I'll switch up if I don't want to eat eggs you know, I'll cook some of the maple sausage with bacon and, you know, things like that. And I'll eat, like, some almonds and peanuts and stuff like that. I kind of switch. Some mornings, then I'll, I'll cook just eggs and eat just the eggs. Um, but chicken every day. Grilled chicken breast, green beans, uh, corn on the cob, stuff like that. But as far as fruit, I don't eat a lot of fruit blueberries and the grapes and it, like a little handful and I just continue to drink water I don't count calories I don't count my grams of protein I don't get that strict with it I just don't have no reason for it um, I'm not knocking it or saying you shouldn't I mean if, if you're doing that that's fine but me personally I just don't have a reason to I, I just I know my own body and I know what I'm trying to do and what I have done has worked for me. So I've been able to build a, a very, very awesome physique uh, eating like this and, and training hard and getting the right amount of sleep. And just, you know, trying different things, different exercise. I'm, I mix body weight training with weights. So that's another thing that I tweaked over time. And I've just learned from different people. I've learned a lot of different things um, through the personal training stuff. So that that's helped me a lot too. And that that's pretty much my diet. That's what I eat on a daily. And I meant my core is, you know, come out pretty nice eating like this. And if if you don't eat the right foods. <laughs> you're you're never going to have that right core um, unless you're young and your metabolism is still really high there's there's certain things that play a factor in that but when you get my age like 30 and the older you get and, you, and you're going to keep eating burgers and fries it's not going to work it, and, and chugging down 
constantly on soft drinks and stuff, you're not going to have a, a fit stomach or healthy body. It's just not going to work. I used to be able to eat like that. I can't do it anymore. But this is the diet. And now I can send people to this video and show you guys what I eat. And if, if you want to eat like this and you want to be on a routine, these are the foods that you're eating, you know, you can give it a try. Um, if you really want to. Like if you just want to use it or if you just want to use some parts of the diet, uh, it's totally up to you. But this is how... I have gotten the physique I've gotten today is I, this is how I ate this is how I eat now and the way I train you know six days a week I rest one day I do three days of part workouts and three days of weight training and this has allowed me to have a, a crazy physique to where I'm at now and I'm thankful though I, I want to keep pushing to new to new limits because I still feel like I'm not where I need to be it sounds crazy but that's just how fitness gurus are but this is it if you have any questions please ask me like on the video and I'm gonna help you as much as possible that's why I made this video so you guys would now have somewhere to go and check this out the diet how I eat so take care stick with it fitness